So we love the Equipter. We use it on our commercial job sites. We use it on our residential job sites. We use it every chance that we can get. Um, it's not only a great tool for keeping the job site clean, making sure that everything goes smoothly and the property's protected, but it's also great for advertising. Being introduced to Equipter was, was social media, seeing stuff online, and when, when we first started seeing it, it was a really cool idea. We didn't know what all it could do. Uh, then we reached out to Equipter, talked to them. They gave us a rundown of it. They gave us uh, not, not a demo, but they sent us video of what it can and can't do. And then when we had the opportunity to go ahead and purchase it and put it in our fleet, we, we jumped on it. When we bought the Equipter, we had a good idea that our homeowners were gonna love it. I mean, that was right off the bat, the idea of protecting their property, that goes pretty hand in hand with what we do. But what was kind of surprising is how much our, our contractors and our subcontractors actually like it. So when our roofers are using it, it cuts down the amount of manual labor they have to do drastically. One of the great things about the Equipter is the way they engineered it. And what I mean by that is the size of the tires that they put on it, specifically to stop it from tearing up yards, even if the yards are wet. So today, the build that we've got going on behind me is in Daytona Beach, Florida. And everybody that knows Florida knows that we can get a lot of rain really quick and the ground really saturates here. So yesterday we had a big storm. We dumped a couple inches of rain in a couple of hours. The ground behind me is very, very saturated. If I were to drive my pickup truck in it, it would get stuck like that. But with it having those big 35 inch tires that I believe are 12 and a half inches wide, we're able to drive it through the grass today. We're not rutting up the grass. We're not causing any property damage. We're not getting the machine stuck. And even fully loaded, we're able to drive it back through the grass without having to worry about tearing anything up, causing those ruts in the yard, anything like that. Our homeowners have been completely amazed at how much or how little effect this piece of equipment has on the ground, even in wet weather. With this being an all-American made piece of equipment, of course we support that. Uh, as far as quality of work, it's second to none. Uh, and it's of course second to none because there's nothing else like it on the market from what I've seen in my experience. Uh, as far as uh, even down to the welds on the bed are great. Everything is clean, everything operates the way it should, you know, just like anything with, with minor maintenance and upkeep, it just keeps going. Uh, with me being former oil field, I've been known to be really tough on equipment and the Equipter has taken everything I've thrown at it. A lot of people talk about the price point on the Equipter, and it's something that if you understand your numbers and you understand how to track your data, you'll understand pretty quickly that it's not really a cost to the company, it's actually an, an investment with a good ROI. So we bought the Equipter a couple years back and it's gone up a little bit in price, but honestly not very much compared to everything else with inflation. But what's really neat about this is we actually track the jobs that we get off of that piece of equipment. And the Equipter paid for itself in the first 18 months, from jobs that we got specifically for having that piece of equipment on the job site that we wouldn't have gotten most likely if we didn't have it on the job site. Equipter did a really amazing job kind of thinking about the little minor details that normally we wouldn't and put it all together into the Equipter which is an amazing piece of equipment. As far as efficiency is concerned the Equipter helps a bunch because the guys aren't having to stop in between the removal of the roof and the installation of the roof and manually pick up shingles and walk around and clean up the job site. Before we had the Equipter, we really prided ourselves on keeping a clean job site, but it would still shut down for 45 minutes, hour, hour and a half to get everything really clean before we started the next step of the process. With this, they don't have to do that. As soon as they're done taking the roof off and getting everything put away, we've already dumped it, we've put it in the trailer, everything's good to go on our side and then they're already getting up there, they're drying the roof in, they're installing shingles, so there's no break in that timeline. I would say if you look at it over like a couple weeks or a month or a year, the amount of jobs that you can squeeze in because of the, the little effects that it has on the efficiency of the job, it's, it's definitely, a, definitely a huge time saver, allows us to get a lot more done.